Hi, Jennifer. I see ya. Hi, Mike. It's letting me go live tonight. Hi, Story of Dory. Hi, honey. Happy birthday again. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know what was going on with YouTube last night. It wasn't me, and it wasn't my phone or my equipment. It was freaking YouTube. You're welcome. No, I'm just letting people know I'm live. I'm already, I'm stressed out tonight. No, it has nothing to do with my husband or me. It has something to do with something I'm not going to talk about here. Yeah, because I went live, and then everybody was telling me that they don't see me live, and but the, and then one time they seen me live but didn't see me. You know, it's like when I went back to look at it, it was nothing but fuzz. You know, it was nothing but fuzz. But that's not why I'm stressed. Jim's fine. I'm fine. I'm just. Mm. things I don't want to talk about here it's if you want to know I will message you other than that Ugh. hey Eileen hey guys I would be doing something paranormal tonight but it's getting ready to rain and like I said I'm stressed out has nothing to do with me or the, I mean, well, it does with me, but not with Jim or the cats or anything. It, if you want to know, I'll message you on, on Messenger later. And I didn't get to meet up with, um, K Dog today because he's still in Daytona. But hopefully he'll be here tomorrow. He said he's still in Daytona, so. K Dog. I'm supposed to meet up with K Dog. Me and Jim. <coughs> I'm supposed to meet up with K Dog. I 
And then hopefully in a couple of weeks, I'll be meeting up with Lou Rock. And hopefully he'll have Patty with him. Yeah, I've been trying to call. He gave me his phone number, and I called him all day. He goes, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I've been helping my uncle move in Daytona. Everything's fine. I'll message you later. Yeah, it's cool. It's warm here tonight, but it's supposed to, with it by 3 o'clock, it's supposed to pour down. Between now and 3 o'clock, it's supposed to pour down. So. More snow. Ugh. No, I'm fine. I'm just, just aggravated. Hit that like button on the way in, please, guys. Share and tweet the stream out. But thank you, Dory. Happy birthday. Hey, Bear. Yeah, I've been in a lot of streams tonight. And Dory's and JoJo's. Oh, yeah. Um, if you haven't heard, I'm sure you've heard of this, this little boy. Let me see where I have the address at. I'm sure you guys have all heard about um, Maddox Hyde, the, one, the little boy that wanted Christmas cards because he's dying of cancer. Well, he sadly passed away today. Um, this is what I heard from Ghost on JoJo's stream tonight. He sadly passed away tonight. Hi, Heaven. So if you would like to send him, his family a card, I can type in the address and you can send his family a card. Because I sent him a Christmas card. And I know a lot of people on, on YouTube sending cards and made videos for him. But I think he was a teenager. I'm not sure of his age, but um, yes. But he was dying of cancer and all he wanted for Christmas was Christmas cards from all over the world. And um, I will put in, I will type in his address and his name. Oh, down here, dummy. Work. 
Miss Zena, there you go. If you would like to send his family a condolences card or something, there's his address. Yeah. I lost it, so I when Ghost put it in JoJo's chat, I wrote it down again. I will be getting him a card and sending one. Because I don't have any condolences cards here. But there is his address if you would like to send his family a, a condolences card or something. There's his address. I'm sure they would appreciate it. They would. It would mean a lot to them. Hello, Wayne. Hello, everybody. I didn't say hi to. Twelve people watching and six likes. Hmm. Yeah, it's going to be a quiet night. This is Zena. This is little Zena. My little lady. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. I bet. I bet. He got a lot. I guarantee you he got a lot. And a lot of people said they made Christmas cards. They made their own Christmas cards for him. But I have Christmas cards, so I just sent him one of the cute ones I have. Yes, this is little Vina. I don't know where. Oh, he's over there. Patchy is. He's over there. He's right there. <laughs> uh. Yeah, yeah. Little Zena. She's my little girl. She's my little girl. My little chubby girl. My little chubby girl. <laughs> Sorry, little man. <laughs> it's okay, little man. Come on. Ugh. That's sweet. I'm glad. That's cool. Yeah, it wasn't the phone. It was freaking YouTube. Because I even tried to go live on my computer and it wouldn't let me. So it wasn't my phone. It was freaking YouTube last night. <laughs> She's a sweetheart. Little love bug. Yeah, because Dory said he didn't get anybody in his stream. That's because we seen what we seen, but everybody else was seeing a blank screen. A fuzzy screen. That's what I seen when I went back to look at their lives before I deleted them was a blank screen. I mean, a fuzzy 
this video is not available kind of thing. And ow, 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 ow. Those are the, come on, turn around, turn around. Those are the earrings that Cardiac sent me. I got them yesterday. They're macalite. They're crystals. The silver, it's silver with macalite. My favorite stone, one of my favorite crystals. The green crystal macal acholite, I think that's how you pronounce it. But they do bother my ears a little bit. Because I haven't had earrings in my ears in a while. I mean, I do have the ones that Emmy sent me. But I don't wear earrings that much. You're okay, Donna. You're okay, hon. You're fine. You're not late. I just started, honey. <laughs> it's been a long day. Now, if you really want to know what's going on, okay. Okay, I had to get a bank account so I could get my PayPal or my YouTube earnings. Well, you know how you have to verify. I don't know if you guys know, but when you get a bank account to get your PayPal earnings, when you get monetized, and there's oh, you got to be up to a certain amount. You got to lay down, baby. Up to a certain amount. Well, I tried to verify. Well, they've got my bank account number. And one of the tests is put in, they put in like anywhere from a penny to a dollar in your account for a test deposit. Well, I did all three and I did one correct and they said it wasn't correct. But the other way is to put in your username and your password to your bank account. I did that, and they're saying it's not right, and it's like, so I'm stuck. But it's the end of the month, and I could use that money. <laughs> Yeah, so I got to figure out how. And AdSense doesn't have an 800 number or anything like that you can get in touch with, which is totally ridiculous. Google does, but you're the the part you get your money from doesn't. And it's like, wait a minute. So I've got to figure out what's going on. I'll figure out something. I'll give it a few days. But now I can, if I ever wanted to do Streamlabs, I can do Streamlabs. I can get paid from, you know, and pay for, paid, paid. I can get money through Facebook Messenger. I can get money on Streamlabs. If I ever do a Streamlabs. Or I can. Plus we ourselves are going to put money back. That account is also for us to put money back. And we have a little extra cash to suck it in the account. Yeah. I got up to that. I've got up to that. Yeah, 100. I've got up to that. Hi, Witch on Wheels. Yeah, they don't. They don't. Yeah, it's 100. And I have up to that. I have that. 
and my verification, my even, I mean, I know because I have the folder to my bank right here and all the information I need. But it's not letting me put it in. So I'm going to give it a few days. And see, I don't do, I don't do taxes because I'm on Social Security. I know you can get your taxes done if you're on Social Security, but I don't do my taxes. I don't do them. Now, when I was working, I used to do tax, my taxes. But I'm on Social Security. I don't do my taxes. So I don't even know how to fill out a tax form, <laughs> let alone do them. So I don't know what's going on. Hi, Melinda. Yes, and I'm wearing her chain, but I will be taking it off before I go to bed because I don't want to break the chain. Uh, the other one I slept, this is another one of her chains. The one I had this on, I slept in it and broke the chain. So it will be going off, taking off when I go to bed. Hi, Melinda. So that's what's making me stressed out. But maybe if I give it a few days, it might, there might. I don't know. Thank you. This is from Cardiac. This was from Cardiac. That's from Cardiac and these earrings. These Macalite earrings are from Cardiac. They're pretty in the light. They're green. They almost look like camouflage. The way they're done. They almost look like camouflage. Uh, yeah, I'm stressed out. Because they should even, if I can't do it the other way, I should be able to do it the other way. But I, they're wanting my tax information, and it's like, I don't do taxes, I'm on disability, I don't do taxes. I know we could get money back, but it wouldn't be much. I don't know how to fill out taxes. I haven't filled out a tax in years. Yes, it was Dory's birthday tonight. Yes, it's hot in here. I should turn the fan on. I think I'll do that. Let me turn this fan on. Right. Now, tomorrow night is going to be not going to be cold cold but it's going to be have a chill in the air hi amber hi hon birthday let's <laughs> yeah i don't celebrate my birthday my husband might make a cake or something and that's it i gotta turn that down hang on little buddy That is on low. It's only got two speeds and it's high and low. So it's on low. Oh. 
So yeah, that's what I said. So it's the end, and it's the end of the month, and it's like... I got another week before I can get paid. Get paid by the government. Hi, Carrie. Don't chew on my neck, my bracelet. Well, hello, Carla. Hi, sis. Mwah. This is Zena. This is Zena. Zena. Little Zena. And then I have Mr. Flash on my lap. This is Zena. And I have Mr. Flash on my lap. Apache is right there. Hi, Joanna. Yeah. My husband named him. His name is Flash. Because he's quick. When he wants to get somewhere, he gets somewhere. <laughs> That's okay, Carrie. I, I, I appreciate you coming in. Yeah. Probably named after the show Flash. The Flash, you know. So, yeah. You're okay, buddy. You're all right. Lay down, sweetie. You're not going to eat yet. You just ate. Yes, you just ate. You're not eating again. That's cool. That's cool. I know, but I don't think it was me. It wasn't me. It was freaking YouTube. Because Dory even went live and didn't have any, hardly anybody in his stream. Because I had one person and then all of a sudden they went nobody. And I know better than that in my stream. I mean, sometimes it takes about three or four minutes for people to show up. But this time it was longer than that. It's like there's something going on. Because I went live three times on my phone. Then I went, got my computer back out and went live on my computer and the same thing happened. So I knew it had to be a YouTube glitch. And my husband used to hate the smell of sage. The sage, now he loves the smell of it. For some reason, he likes the smell of it. He's probably gotten used to it because I've been using it. So I have sage sitting out. Hopefully, Indy doesn't knock it off the table because he's laying in front of it. The little sage bowl, you know, the little thing you sit the, 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 the bowl on, that little shell-looking bowl, I have sage sitting in it. It's not burning right now, but it was today. I got to order me some more sage. I'm about out. That's cool, Bridget. That's cool. I'd love to have one of them lamps. I think they are even... With what they do, I think they are. I think they're gorgeous. I love them lamps. I love the way they look. And happy late birthday, Bridget. Unless today's your birthday or yesterday. And happy birthday to you, sis. And Bridget, I don't care what anybody else says or 
whatever, you're always welcome here. This is your home when I'm on live. You're always welcome here, sis. Don't ever think you're not. No matter who or what, you're always welcome here. Yes, you're always welcome here. Prayer says, prayers, Carla. Today's your dad. Well, happy birthday in heaven, Bridget's dad. Yes, you're always welcome here, sis. No matter what, you're always welcome here. No, she said when she left the other night, she didn't feel welcome. I said, no, you are always welcome here. When she left the other night, she said she wasn't welcome. Didn't feel welcome. Well, you're welcome here. Anytime you want to pop in or whatever, even for a second, you're welcome here. Like everybody else is. My dad's birthday's in the spring. My mom's birthday's in the spring. So, no. One's in June and one's in July, so. <clears throat> and mine's in the spring. Mine's not till April. Oh. Uh. Hang on. I know Greg did a card reading today, but and I thumbs up it, but I was watching another stream at the time. Go lay down somewhere, baby. That's okay, Bridget. Like I said, last night, it was YouTube. It wasn't me. You have to lay down right here, baby. You can't be spread out all over my computer, honey. I have to log into my hi cardiac hi hon indy <laughs> you fell off didn't you <laughs> hi maurice hi hon all right you don't like your ears rub cardiac will put it in my PayPal and stuff like that. <clears throat> That's okay, Bridget. That's all right, honey. That's okay. That's okay. That's not a problem, honey. No problem. Um... So hopefully I can figure out how to verify my account with my AdSense so I can have enough so I can get that money out and get some kitty food for my kitties.
Well, I'm glad you're home. How are you feeling, Maurice? Morris. Maurice. How are you feeling, honey? And sorry, I call everybody honey and babe, so it's nothing personal. I mean, nothing like that. I call everybody that. So it's... I've always done that. I don't know why. I've always done that. So it's just something I do. Um, I'm glad. I'm glad. Yes, Carla. <laughs> Boop. I love you too, sis. I do. I love everybody. I love you. I love everybody here. You guys are my family. Like Cav said today, like Cav7 said today, some people don't have any friends, they don't have much family, which I don't, and I don't have any friends. The only real friend I have is Mama Cat, that's outside of YouTube, and we don't visit each other much, I mean, because she's going through a lot of health stuff right now, so... Yeah, it works. It was YouTube last night, James. It wasn't me. It was YouTube. Yeah, she's going to have surgery. Yeah, she's going to have surgery. On her foot. Yeah. <coughs> now, hopefully, hopefully, K-Dog will call me tomorrow. Hopefully. He will call me tomorrow. Because I gave him the address to the Walmart he can park the RV at. <laughs> unless they're driving their car. I don't know. But if they come with the RV... They can park at the Walmart down the street. And then I can meet them there and bring them back here because they want to meet my kitties. And my hubby. Which my husband will probably be with me. Hi, Paul. Hi, hon. But um, I'm hoping we can meet up somehow. Today he was still in Daytona. I called him three or four times, just like, call me, call me, call me. And then he texts me later and goes, I'm sorry, I was just got off work. I'm still helping my uncle move. It's like, uh, Because uh. <laughs> I was already, I was dressed and ready to go when I got up. Yes, honey. You love doing that. <laughs> That's fine, hon. Thank you, James. Wonder poop. <laughs> PT done on my lungs. I got I got told I need to lose weight. Ooh. Weight does, I mean, to be honest, Paul, nothing against you and me because I was there too. Six months ago, I weighed almost 200 pounds. And my lungs felt, ugh, you want to know, the weight when you're heavy, because I've not always been heavy, but the last five or six years I have been heavy. My weight has gone up and down close to 200. 
And I don't know how I've lost this much weight in six months. But I'm down to 100 and about 160 from 200. And weight has a lot to do with your breathing. Because now that I've lost the weight, my lungs feel better. I mean, I haven't, I don't eat as much. When I sit down to eat, I don't eat as much as I used to. I used to be able to eat, you know, eat a big portion of food when I sit down to eat. Now I barely eat that. I barely eat a whole plate. Yes, it can do that too. Yes, it can. It can make your back hurt too. Because I have back problems with my scoliosis, curvature of the spine. Yeah. It can do that too. So I know the feeling. And Jim's lost a lot of weight since he's been sick. He used to weigh about 170, 180. Now he's down to 150. Well, the two weeks he didn't eat, you know, from being sick, he couldn't eat. He couldn't stomach anything. So we both lost a lot of weight in six months. <sighs> yeah, Jim, Jim's cut back on his sugars. And I used to drink a lot of soda. Like, I'd go through four or five cans of soda in one day. I only drink two. And I have juice in the fridge now. I have, well, I have a Arizona green tea sitting in the fridge waiting on me. Oh man, that's not good, Amber. I've got when I I'm sorry to say this, but when I wear a bra, it has to be comfortable because of my under my lungs, underneath, I guess, because the bottom part of my lungs don't work. So it has to be comfortable because if it cuts into my ribs, it I have a problem breathing for some reason. But um thank you, cardiac and James. I appreciate that. But um <clears throat> yeah. I mean, I I still crave my I still eat my chocolate and my sweets, but I don't eat as much as I used to. Like we had chili dogs tonight. I had one. And that's all I wanted. And last night we had homemade chicken nuggets. They were homemade. Chicken nuggets and homemade french fries. And his, he's got a new tester now that his insurance paid for. Um, so he can check his sugar twice a day. And tonight he said his sugar was 130. Is that good? To have your sugar at 130 is at 130. Is that good to be at? Thank you, Wayne. Oh man, Paul. Um, his stomach's fine. Welcome back, Bridget. He does it before he eats dinner, and we ate dinner at four, five. He does it before uh, before he eats in the morning, before he has his coffee and stuff, and then he does it before dinner. Yeah, carrots and strawberries have sugar. Uh, 
I'm not sure. I have to ask him. He's tight too. I have to ask him what his morning one is. I should tell him. He should be keeping a log of it. Maybe I have to get him a book, a little book, where he can write down his daily, his daily readings. He needs to get a lot, a journal for that, and keep down his daily readings. But it doesn't usually go over 130. Maybe 135, maybe, but it doesn't go much higher than that. It hasn't gone much higher than that, unless it did at the hospital. I don't know. Because before, when he was sick, he didn't have a tester because his old tecker, tester took crap. So he went and called his insurance, and they sent, they told him what tester they cover, and he went to Walmart and ordered it from the pharmacy. <laughs> and Carla. Yeah, I would keep the track of your sugar, hon. Yeah, I'm going to get him a, a book. Um, and I'm going to have him start, <coughs> start keeping a log. <coughs> Of his reading. He probably is. Mine drives me crazy. Believe me, mine drives me crazy. Uh, his sugar has never been really, really high. His sugar has never been really, really high. So. Okay. You're okay, honey. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <coughs> you like a lot of singles? Yeah, I would love to have one of them, man. But I don't know where I'd put it. I'd have to put it up high because the cats would knock it off. I would have to put it on that table and like surround that table with something so they wouldn't jump on it. The little end table over there that I have the sage on. I went through my entire house today from that bedroom to the back bedroom with all the windows open. Because today it was such a nice day, we had the windows open. It's in the 70s, so. <clears throat> you all right, buddy? You all right, you're a fat belly. So, yeah. Come on. Come at it, baby girl. Come on. Well, it's supposed to, it's got up to almost 80 today, believe it or not. Almost. Let me see if this rain hit us yet. <laughs> About four o'clock. About four a.m. we'll get rain. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're supposed to get rain tomorrow. This morning and tomorrow. Um, 45 tomorrow night, so it's going to be cold again. If it wasn't raining, I'd go outside and do something and do spirit box. I would have done spirit box, but I didn't want to go outside and chance the rain. Hi, Rattle. How you doing? Sorry I couldn't stay long, hon. Yeah, it's coming from over there, I think. Oh, no. But it looks like the rain, James, is coming from Texas. It's coming this way. <sighs> yeah, it's supposed to be chilly at night the rest of the week. And Dell wants to update. And I tell him, no, I don't want to update yet. My computer wants to update. I keep telling it, no, not right now. <clears throat> yeah. Like I said, I the news said earlier, and this is my app is saying three. Three, four o'clock. But the news said about one. So. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I heard about that cafe. I heard about that cafe. <sighs> I have one on my lap, too, Eileen. I have one on my lap, too. I have an aunt named Eileen, but we call her Pat. P-A-P, -P, because she looked like a little Indian baby when she was born. That's what my grandmother and mom said. When my aunt Eileen was born, she looked like a little Indian baby. <clears throat> Looking what up, Carla? Oh, yeah. The only Maine Coon I have. Trying to be a lap dog. <laughs> yeah, it's a cafe that's full of cats. You can go there and have coffee. You can have a cat sit with you and keep you company. Um, yeah. Like they have, well, they used to have a, they used to have a, it's no longer around that I know of. It's called, it used to be called Dog Water Cafe. And you used to be able to bring your dogs in there and they, your food bowls look like dog bowls. I think it went out of business, but you could bring your dog in there. Um. And your food bowls, your your food would come in dog bowls. Or not real dog bowls, but bowls that look like dog bowls. Go on, sweetie. <laughs> oh, we don't have one here. Not yet. I'm sure they'll be going here soon. We have a lot of, there's few restaurants in Tampa, like, that allow dogs. I don't know about cats, but I know there's a few that allow dogs. And I know Walmart allows service animals, but I know other people bring their pets in there, and they tell, and they they don't have the coat you're supposed to have for the service animal. You know, the service animal vest. But, yeah. Oh, baby. Hi, the baby. It's a baby, 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 baby. What are you looking for? Cardiac?
I don't think we have one. Yeah, she is spoiled. She is very spoiled. Very spoiled. <laughs> and she'll sit right there. She won't move. I don't know if we have one. Oh, yeah, we do. I think we do. I think it does. Hang on. Oh, yeah. We have one in Tampa. We have one. It's called Furry Tales, Cat, Furry Tales Cat Cafe. Yeah, we have one in Tampa. I just looked it up. Hi, Tri Trixie Wiggs. Happy birthday. But yeah, we have a cat cafe here in Tampa. You're welcome. Yeah, we have a cat. It's called Furry. Oh, on the way. Oh, it's coming to Tampa. It's coming to Tampa. It's coming to Tampa. We will have a cat cafe here. But I was so hoping that I could get a hold of K Dog this morning when I got up. It's like, dang it, boy, answer the phone. At least answer me back. At least message me back. Let me know something. And it's like, <laughs> And then this stuff with my AdSense account. Oh. She's purring too. You can't hear it, but she's purring. Hey, Keenan, Keenan. How are you doing? You have to go. Why do you have to go? Keenan, okay, Keenan. Hi, Keenan, how you doing? She'll stay right there. Look at her markings. Oh, her markings, pretty. Look at her markings. Okay, that's no problem. That's no problem. You get some sleep, Keenan. Have a good night. You have a good night, hon. Cardiac, I was showing off your earrings. If you're still here, Cardiac, I was showing off your earrings. Okay, Eileen. Yeah, they almost look like camouflage. I mean, I know they're Macalite, Machula, I don't know how to pronounce that. But the design on them, they look like almost like camo, camouflage. With the black and the green. They almost look camouflage. And I haven't wore earrings in a little while, so they it's not that they're making them red, it's just that I haven't wore earrings in a while. And I had to re I had to push these through because my earring my ears were getting ready to close. So I got to start wearing earrings again or they're going to close on me.
hair, my hair. What well, baby girl, lay down, sweetie. You want your belly rub? You want your belly rub? She want her belly rub. Yeah, my ears, I got to start wearing earrings. My ears want to close. See, I have two holes in each ear. I have the front ones and I have ones behind them. I have two holes in each ear. These were done the old-fashioned way. My first ear holes were done the old-fashioned way. My other ones were done by a machine in the mall. It's a good chico. It's a good chico. <laughs> Thank you, Trixie. I appreciate that. You're welcome here anytime, hon. Yes, you are. Usually we sit here and BS, talk about anything and everything. Sometimes I do paranormal. I do cards. I sing karaoke when I feel like it. I do, 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 do. Ooh. Another kitty must have got you on the nose. Yes. We all get along here. We're all family here, Trixie. Trizzy. Trizzy, we're all here. We're all family here. I'm not really into jazz that much. Um, the only people I've really, I mean, I don't know if he's jazz, but B.B. King and but I think that's R&B. Really, I'm not into really into jazz that much. Um, not really. I've heard, I've listened to jazz, but I couldn't pick an artist. I'm more, I'm like Story of Dory. I like my rock and roll, my 80s, 80s hair bands. Like I said, I'm going to see Ozzy and I'm going to see White Snake. And we might put a third concert on this year. Brit Floyd is coming. Brit Floyd, they're a cover band for Pink Floyd. And the, from what I can see online when I've looked at their page and stuff, they're awesome. They put on a light show and everything like Pink Floyd used to. And my husband loves Pink Floyd. And this is Pepper. Yes, everybody show love to each other. You're not the black sheep. You're not the black sheep, Carla. No, you're not. And this is Pepper. Yeah, everybody show some love to, to everybody, hon. You like the black sheep? <laughs> well, actually, I'm the black sheep of my real family. Little man. Got me with his nail. You can't be up here. Go lay down somewhere. You're going to follow me with them nails? No. No, he... Yes, a lot of families have black sheep. I know I'm the black sheep in mine. I think my bro my husband is of his, but at least his family talks to him. Mine, the only one that talks to me in my family is my blood sister. And my older brother that's in spirit. <coughs> Go. 
You're very welcome, Trichy. Trizzy. You're one girl with four brothers. Well, I had, it was me, and I had three brothers and two sisters. One sister is still living, and two brothers are still living. My one sister I, I met when I was very little. I don't remember if I, I really don't remember if I ever met her. But my oldest sister said I have met her. Um, my oldest brother got, is one of my um, guardians, is one of my protectors in spirit. He watches over me. You don't go. Uh, hang on a minute, guys. Uh, Hold on, guys. I'll be right with you. I will get a rag. I'll be right back. So she decided to fall off the side of the desk. so it goes out into the dirty clothes outside the dirty towels later uh. go a little hard headed The only one I talk to is my sister, and we talk on occasion. You're number three of six boys. Dang. I'm the baby out of seven. Dang. See, all my brothers and sisters are half. I mean, I the brother that has passed on... And the sister I talked to have the same dad. Or the sis the two sisters, the one that's deceased, and the brother that's deceased, and the one sister I talked to all have the same dad. But they have different moms. Their moms are not my mom. My husband my dad was married like four times. Um, my mom was married twice. So that my two brothers that are living have a different dad. And the brother and two sisters have a different mom.
So I'm like, I have all half the half brothers and sisters. Now you want to cuddle, huh, boy? You want to cuddle, baby? Are you okay? I give you some medicine again. You were getting better. You're getting better. Got a little bit of a cold. Yeah, I know. I I seen his thing, and I was already in. I was in somebody else's stream at the time. I converse, and I was in a conversation. I was actually. I think I was watching South Cap Seven because I tell you what. Cap7 hits the nail on the head about a lot of stuff when it comes to YouTube. I swear to God he does. Forgive me, but I swear he does. That's why I love him so much. I love my Cap7. He is so awesome. My dad, I didn't, didn't even really know that well. I mean, the best, he did the best he could. He died when I was 11 years old of cancer. For those that don't know. And that's one thing I've always been interested in the paranormal because I stayed home the day he died. My mother went up, went to the hospital, and on the way up in the elevator at the veterans hospital, he passed away. And the minute he passed away, or around the time he passed away, his spirit was standing in my living room. I remember it as clear as day. And I wasn't afraid. I sensed something was there. And I looked up. And there he stood. Now I haven't seen the spirit of my mother. She died in 03. That's okay. No problem. I completely understand, Bridget. Get some rest. Um, get... Go and just try to relax, Bridget. Um, I can't remember what I used to do, used to use for a headache rem for a hangover remedy. There used to be something I used to do for a hangover remedy from drinking, but it's been so many freaking years. I mean, a long, long time since I've gotten drunk, drunk. I mean, I don't do that no more. I don't even go near it. But back when I used to drink, which when I worked in the bars is when I mostly drank. But I'd come home and it's like, ugh, my head would hurt. <laughs> but, um, no. I can't remember the remedy I used to use. It takes some, yeah, take some Tylenol. Right, Anita. Get some sleep. Or try to relax. Try to relax, honey. Try to relax. I can't remember what I used to do. It's been... So long ago that I've even touched touched real alcohol. Long, I mean, many years, many, 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 many years. Dang it, little lady, little man. 
There's nothing in there, honey. There's nothing in there. And this is little Apache. This is my Apache. He's having a good night tonight. He has his good days and his bad days. With the head tilt, he has his good days and his bad days. But he plays. He runs through the house like something's after him. I mean, he acts like there's nothing wrong with him. He's a normal kitten. He acts like a normal kitten. So. Oh, no. I said yes. You're not scratching me. You're not scratching me. So. No, he just. Sorry, cat walked across my freaking computer again. You guys there? Say something. Okay. One cat walked across my computer, and then I'm tired of a little man being back here because he just fell on my back and scratched me so i don't want him on the back of my chair i'm sorry very funny carla all right eileen you have an awesome night hun Hi Tara, how's your dad? Good night, Eileen. Have an awesome night. Be blessed. Be safe, sweetheart. Yeah, that's what I just asked. How's your dad? Oh man. Guys, keep praying for his for her dad, please. Keep the prayers going. Keep the prayers going for Tara's dad. Keep the prayers going. Come on. Keep the prayers going, guys. Because that was such good news yesterday. Now he's going backwards. So keep the prayers, guys. Keep the prayers. That's okay. That's okay, Tara. That's all right. I understand, honey. Because like I said in Cab 7, prayers, prayers work, man. You guys prayed for Anaki's son. You guys prayed for my husband. Prayers work. We have enough prayer people out there, prayer warriors out there. We, things can happen. Things can happen. Well, what do you want to do? 
What do you want to do, Tara? What do you want? What do you want to happen? Do you want to say goodbye or do you want to try the transfusion? I know it's hard to say goodbye, believe me, I know. Thank you, Amber. He's refusing transfusion. He's refusing it. Yes, very true, Maurice. Oh, this is um this is little flash. And then this one is this is Apache. That's flash. And that's little Apache. Come oh, buddy. Oh, baby. Don't lay on the computer, hon. I know you're hungry, aren't you? Ow. That thing you see is my fan. Because it is a little warm in here tonight. Hi, San. How you doing? Yeah, but I knew. Yeah, but after tomorrow night, it's supposed to be back down in the 40s. Tomorrow night. After this rain, it's supposed to be back down in the 40s tomorrow night. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. He was the one that Amber said was shot. Well, it's in the 70s, the 60s here. Uh, lay down there, Lashy. 71. But after it rains, it's supposed to get cold again. Yes, we're glad you're home. And we're glad you're doing much better. Yes. Forty-five hollow point. Oof. My dad used to have a forty-four magnum. He used to I think it was a forty-four. Could have been a forty-five. That's who taught me how to shoot. Shoot a gun anyway. When I was little, he taught me told me how shot he taught me how to shoot a gun at eleven years old. Ten years old. It was before he got sick. Yes, James, how are you doing if you're still here? <coughs> Yes, thank you. Yes, we're all going to pray. I pray every night. I also got a message from my spirit family, too. Thanks to my sweet, sweet Diane.
Same old, same old. How many streams you in right now, James, may I ask? Yes, right now, the best way, if you want to donate, is PayPal because I'm having issues verifying my account with AdSense, my bank account. All you have to do is get in touch with her on Messenger. Just say, Diane, it's Amber. Can I ask you a question and see if she can get in touch when she has a chance? Because I don't rush her. I just ask and let her do it in her time. That's, yes, that's very true. That's very true. Yeah. Yeah, she's told me when we, when I first met her and we got to know each other, she has contacted my family members and told me things that nobody, nobody, none of you know that she wouldn't know. And she hit on so many things, so many things, and was correct about my my family, my husband, my dad, my mom, and nobody, I don't tell anybody this stuff. The only one that knows about this stuff is my husband and my family, my blood family. And it's like, wow. So anybody that says Diane's a fake is wrong. Yeah. Jesus described my dad and my brother. And my mom. And she's also seen my grandmother. Because my grandmother's name has come through. And so has his mom. Her name came through one time. To her. Her middle name. Not her first name, her middle name. But everybody, I could say Joyce, that's his mom's name, is Joyce. Nobody knows her middle name. And my grandmother's name was Edith, but they didn't know. Nobody knows her middle name. Just two for now. That's what I just said. How many streams are you in? <coughs> <coughs> That's probably because Patty, Marie, and none of the others are probably live. There's probably not too many people. I was also in Boomer's stream tonight. Haven't seen Boomer in a long time. Or earlier tonight.
You see, I really don't get on YouTube until about after dinner. Sometimes I might get on a little earlier, but usually it's like 4 5 o'clock. It's after, right? When he's making dinner. Around the time he makes dinner. Yeah, it has been glitching. I know it. I know it was glitching last night. Yes, yeah, Carla, where you at, honey? Oh, she's probably laying down. She probably fell asleep. Carla, did you fall asleep? <coughs> Sorry. Oh, she's she's live. Okay. Then if you if she's not live, then it's not a live stream. <laughs> uh, what, baby? I've got to sit up. Finish it up. All right, Tara. Okay, Anita, you and Wayne have an awesome evening. Get some sleep. Be blessed. Be safe. Sleep well, sis. Hey, Irish. Sorry I missed your stream. I was in a couple of other streams at the time, and it's like, whoa. As in boomers and cap sevens. Sorry. Big belly baby. Yes, good night, Wayne and Anita. Have an awesome evening. Get some sleep. I will see you back here tomorrow night. Maybe we'll do something besides sit here tomorrow night. Maybe I'll, it won't be nothing outside because it'll be cold, but we'll do something. We will do something. Huh, baby. If we do, 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 do. I can sit here and rock him, and he'll just lay there. He won't move. He won't wake up either. 
I'll sit here and go like this with him. And he won't wake up. He'll just lay there. Yep. That's my kitties. They're spoiled. I'll be right back. I Sit right here. Don't get on the computer. I'll be right back. I am hoping that now he's on my lap. I am hoping that um, K Dog does call me tomorrow. Hope he doesn't call me too early. Because <laughs> I don't know how long this rain is going to rain. I don't know how long it's supposed to last. But I'm anxious to meet up with him. And if I have to, I'll drive to Tampa. It's not that far from here. 45 minutes, depending on traffic, or an hour. 45 minutes to an hour, maybe, maybe not even that, depending on traffic. From here to Tampa. Depending on the interstate or the roads, the main, main roads. Yeah, he's supposed to, well, he's in Daytona. He said he'll be in the Tampa Bay area today, but he was still helping his uncle move. So, and he just got off work. I mean, wonder what he means by just got off work. I said, he doesn't live in Daytona. <laughs> That's the message he sent me. He said, I just got off work. I'm still helping my bro my uncle. Uncle, I think, move in Daytona. Because he went there first to pick up his tickets for the race. And then he was helping his uncle move. And then he'd be over this on the side of the, He'd be on this side of Florida. Because he's going to be here till after the race. He's going to be in Florida until after the race. Yeah, it probably does. Moving ain't nothing nice. Moving ain't nothing nice. <laughs> Believe that. Packing up and moving is nothing nice. What, now you want to play, huh? Now you want to play? <laughs> You're going to fall. <laughs> uh-uh. Why do they all want to chew on my bracelet? My amber bracelet. They all want to chew on it. There. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. And he always tells me when I was in his live stream, I'm coming to Florida. I'm coming to Florida. Because <clears throat> he is from where I'm from. He is from, from Indiana. I'm from Indiana, but he's from, I think, the east side of Indiana or the west side of Indiana, and I'm from the southeast. I'm from the other side. I'm from the southeast part of Indiana, and he's from the west. Hi, Belinda. 
His RV was broke down. Well, they do have a car. He said he did have a car. That's what he told me. Even if they drive their car over there, over here. I really can't, I don't think I could drive to Daytona. Because I've never been to Daytona. I mean, I've been to New Smyrna Beach, which is right below Daytona with his daughter, but she was driving. And you're getting a bath tomorrow before it gets cold. Lay down, baby. It's okay. Lay down. You're okay. I'm getting sick again. I gotta get you some more meds. The hell? Oh, in the litter box back there. Stop. Ah. Oh, there he's somebody's playing with something in the kitchen on the floor. Hang on a minute, guys. I'm here. Hang on a minute, there, buddy. Oh, should have known it was you. I should have known. You ever seen a you ever seen a cat scratch in front of the water dish, like on the floor, before they drink water? Well, I have two cats that do that. Robin's one of them. She scratches the floor before she takes a drink. She's done that since she's a kitten. It's like, that's weird. Never seen a cat do that before. Her and another one. Her and I can't remember the other one, but she does that. She's done that since she's a kitten. She'll scratch in front of the water dish before she takes a drink. Then she'll put her paws on the side of the water dish, because I have a big one. And if it's half full or less than half full, she'll tip it. <laughs> so I make sure it's full. Because if I don't, she'll tip it. Because she scratches and then she sits on the sides and goes like this and it's like weird <laughs> it's like when i first seen her do that it's like whoa because <laughs> i've never seen a cat do that <coughs> <coughs> she'll also do that sometimes when she gets before she gets into the litter box She'll scratch outside the litter box and then she'll jump in the litter box and scratch and do her business. Mm -hmm. Hey, Carla. <coughs> <coughs> there she is right there. That's Robin right there. Robin, and that's Tabby. Can't see who that other cat is over there. But she's done that since she's a kitten. I found her outside. One of one of my past neighbors moved out. And left her and she was only a kitten she was um Zena's size 
she was as big as Zena when I found her. And she's been with me ever since. She's been in my home ever since. <clears throat> yeah, share the stream out, tweet it out if you want. Let people know I'm live if they would don't want, if they want to come and join, don't matter. Yeah, does me too, but it happens all the time. It's like tonight, Miss Pat, we call her, I call her Miss Pat. She's one of the ones we, I do talk to on occasion, but I wouldn't trust her with your life. Um, or my life, actually. But um, she called me and said, are you missing a cat? Do you have a cat over here? I said, no, why? But I went over to see to make sure it wasn't one of my cats. Because when she said dogs were chasing it and had it cornered, it's like I went over there immediately. And the pit bulls had a cat cornered under the trailer over there. And it was an old cat. Looked like he was on his last leg, but... They had him underneath the trailer where he couldn't get out. And then when I tried to put my hand in there, the pit bull was on. They couldn't reach me. The pit bull couldn't. But he was growling at me. And I yelled out. I said, this pit bull bites me. He's going to the freaking pound. And I told him, I said, I'm so sick and tired of these pits. Cornering these cats. And chasing these cats. I told him, I told him right to his face because he come and got his dog. I said, I catch him in my yard and I'm calling the pound. Because they run 24-7 here in Florida, here in my park. And then when I tried to reach in and grab, it was, I think he's a stray. But I, I've never seen him over here where I'm at over on my side and he looked like an old cat and he was sitting in a puddle of water mud and water and when i reached in to try to grab him he swatted at me so i know he's feral so because i was going to try and reach in and get him out of that mud you know at least drag him out from underneath the trailer And, and then finally they come and got the dog and it's like, uh, I told him, I said, I catch him in my yard, they corner one of my cats, or they try to attack me, you better say bye bye to your dogs, because I'm not going to put up with it. I mean, a lot of people in this park are tired of it. A lot of people are waiting they're waiting for something to happen is what they're waiting for i'm not because i don't want one of my cats to end up dead that's why i have morris in the house at night they cornered morris about four days ago about three or four about four days ago they had more morris cornered my orange big orange cat <clears throat> they had him cornered so he comes in the house at night. My other cats, most of them stay in my yard. Them dogs have no right coming in my yard. Leo's in my yard. Blaze stays on the roof. That girl stays in my yard. There's a couple cats that, lit, that sleep under my car. They don't sleep in my car. They sleep under it. And the rest sleep on my porch. There's a couple that sleep on my porch. I don't think Morris is... Mar Maurice, are you still here? Or did he go to bed? Hey, I've gotten a lot of my kitties that way, Amber. A few of my kitties have come that way. People just throw them out. Um, the two calicos, the twin calicos, Tabby, the neighbors, 
right here. Not these neighbors, but the ones on the other side that I can't stand. Um, I was feeding Tabby outside. She was so hungry, she couldn't eat enough. And the neighbors walked by and said, yeah, the neighbors behind me threw her and threw two other cats out. Because they didn't want to take it. They didn't want to feed them anymore. They couldn't feed them anymore. Why have them if you can't feed them? <clears throat> so I brought them all in and they're in the house now. And they're well fed. They don't want for nothing. If I don't have cat food, they get human food. Bobby. You're here in Bobby? Bobby, okay. Now I got to make it into one of his streams. I, I see him live, but I never make it in. Lay down, baby. It's okay, honey. You, I got you. I got you. You ain't gonna fall. You're okay. I got you, baby. Bobby the brat. Yeah, as you see, my house is pretty peaceful. My cats are pretty peaceful. Only once in a while, they get a, some of them get a wild hair and run through the house like a crazy person. You know how they say cats run through the house when you're sleeping? Not mine. They all sleeping. All sleeping. Yeah. Now, during the day, sometimes, I mean, usually the one that gets the wild hair is um, either Tabby or one of the Calicos, one of the tortoiseshells. Now, these two, the kittens, Apache and Flash, they'll get together. They'll lay together on the table, on the coffee table. And then Apache will get a wild hair and he'll want to play. He'll want to fight with, play fight with um, Flash. Yeah, mine, that's all they do is sleep. Sleep, eat, and go to the bathroom. And like I said, once in a while, a few of them will get a wild hair. And Shaggy's doing okay. He's doing a little better than he was. He was looking really rough there for a minute. But he's doing okay. He's still living. He's still kicking. When he passes, it's going to really hurt because he's my heart. He's one of the originals I started out with. <laughs> Belinda, you still here? Amber's calling you. I figured that John would be live. It's J 
John's life. HSFL's life. Sorry, guys. You got Belinda out of the woodwork. <laughs> Hi, Denise. That picture you put on Messenger, nothing ever shows up. I don't know why, but every time you put whatever you put on Messenger, it, there's nothing there. It's black. Denise. So I don't know what the picture is, but it's a black picture. Nothing. So I just figured I would let you know. in the camera. You're going to fall. If I don't move you, you're going to fall off my lap. Ugh. But thank you, Cardiac, for the gifts. They're beautiful. And now we have matching rings. All three of us. These earrings are beautiful. I love these earrings. I love these earrings. Just, I mean, just the design on how the Macalite, the black and the green, are mixed together on them. <clears throat> yes, we are sisters. We are sisters, always and forever. Okay, yes, they are very, they are very pretty. Thank you. You have an awesome evening. Get some sleep, sis. May God bless. Peace, light, and kitties. You know that. Have a blessed evening. Sleep well. We will see you tomorrow night. Or tomorrow, whenever. We may run into some each other somewhere in somebody else's stream. But good night, sis. Oh, Cardiac, before you leave, how is um, Matt doing? <sighs> she must have already left. I'll ask her. When I get done here, I'll ask her how Matt's doing. She'll answer me tomorrow, probably.
I don't think I'm going to have too much long of a stream. I don't know. We'll see. Um, yes, me, Carla, and Cardiac have the rings. The same rings. I just look blurry to an extent. Maybe I have to adjust my camera. I have to adjust the setting. <laughs> it could be the lighting too. But yeah. It's a blizzard here, so don't tell me it's cold, sis. <laughs> I'm not cold. I guess it's in seven. It's 72. But after this rain comes through, supposed to be in the 40s tomorrow night. The coldest is going to be a week from, it's going to be next Wednesday. The coldest night is going to be next Wednesday. 42. 44 tomorrow night. 44, 48, 47, 42, 49, 60s and 50s during the day for the next week, next week or so. 60s and 50s, 60s during the day. Been snowing there for, oh man. I mean, I would love to go back up in the snow. I'd love to go back up in the snow. It's the cold that comes with it that I won't, I might not be able to handle. But I used to love living up there in the snow when I, because I'm from Indiana, so it's like, yeah, I used to love the snow. But I don't think my body could handle the cold weather because I can't handle it here when it gets below 50. Or gets below 60, actually. <sighs> it gets below 60 and I freeze. My blood's so thinned out from being in Florida. Because they say you live in Florida long enough, your, your blood thins out. Because of the heat. Oh, man, Cardi Carla. 60, I suntan. <laughs> 60, in hand, I can handle. Below that, forget it. <coughs> I mean, there's a little chill in the air with 60. I mean, we had the windows open and everything today. Uh, my husband, after bitching that he can't stand the smell of the sage, the real sage, he wanted me to light it and take it through the whole house. So I lit it and I said prayers while I had it light it under my breath. So he wouldn't, you know, he's not into that stuff. So um, he's not into the spiritual stuff when it has to go with spirits and stuff. You don't believe that. But um, I took it from our bedroom to the back bedroom. And every nook, cranny, crevice, door, window, room between. And said prayers and told whatever negative entities, energies that ate it. Oh, I believe it. I believe it. Because you guys get cold up there. I know that. I know that. Because like I said, I'm from up north. I'm from up north. <clears throat> oh. 
Pro. You okay, Maggie? She turned, rolled off the fridge. She went to roll over and fell off the fridge. Maggie, you okay, honey? Maggie. She must be fine. She's running around like nothing's happened. One of these times you're going to land wrong. You don't need to be up there, Maggie. She sleeps on top of my refrigerator. She went to roll over and went straight down. And she didn't break anything. She's running like a normal cat. If there was a way I could block off the top of the refrigerator, I would. I can't put a shelf up there because if I put a shelf up there, I'd have even more cats up there. Oh, man. Guys, stay in your houses. Stay warm. Stay warm, guys. Please, I'll be praying for you. Believe me, I will. Because I've been through the blue, I've been through the snow, and I was in Indiana in the blizzard of '78. I was in Indiana. <clears throat> I was in Indiana in the blizzard of '78, and that same that next, I think it was one of the years we were down here, and it snowed here. I lived in St. Petersburg. I went. I was in grade school at the time, elementary school. Because after my grandfather passed away, we moved back down here. No, before we moved back up. At, when we moved, before we moved back up north, it snowed here after Dad passed. The same year my dad passed, it snowed here, if I can remember correctly, because it snowed, but it snowed here, and it hit the ground and melted, and it hasn't snowed in my, my part of Florida since then, and we lived here. And it snowed that same winter here, but it hit the ground and melted. And then the next winter, we went back up north, or back up north for till I was 18. And I was in the blizzard of 78 up there. The winter before my father passed, it snowed here. The winter after my father passed, I built that. <clears throat> well, that's okay, Amber. I can put. I understand about the stomach wanting to act up. What are you doing? You want to say hi? When you say hi? Boop, 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 boop. Uh, Patchy. He's having a good night tonight. But even with his head like this, he acts like a normal cat. I mean, like it doesn't even bother him. He plays and runs around. During the day, bugs the heck bugs the heck out of me all the time, huh? Yes, you do. Huh. That's okay. That's okay, Carla. I understand. Eat some more crackers. What do you mean? <sighs> oh, you're talking to her. All right, Carla, you have a good night, sis. Much love, sweetheart. You know I love you. You get some sleep, sweetie. I hope you get the feeling better, hon. All 
I hope that stuff I hope that stuff gets goes away soon. Carla, I hope that stuff goes away soon. I don't like to see anybody hurting or in pain. Aww. Good night, sis. Like I said, I may not have a very long stream. I might get off of here about 2.30. I said we might do something tomorrow night. I don't know what. You don't like me to hold you anymore. You just want to be petted, head butted. He likes to butt heads. I don't know why, but he likes to butt heads. Huh. It's a belly. Gitty belly, gitty belly. <laughs> My babies. Oh, I hate having a stomach ache. I hate having my stomach hurt. I know how you feel. I hate that. I hate having my stomach hurt. What do you want? You're not eating yet until I'm offline. I don't care. No. You're going to wait. You're going to wait. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yeah, crackers are good for your stomach. Crackers are good. So, um, saltine. Yeah. So, saltine crackers, soda crackers. If you know what soda crackers are. Um, saltine crackers are good for your belly. Yes, they are. Oh, I know what we can have for dinner tomorrow night. If it's going to be... Ah, get down. Sorry about that. <sighs> even though it's good for lunch, we can have it for dinner. Because me and him, we eat like two bad... I mean, even though we're together, we eat like two single people. Because we eat what you can have for lunch for dinner. Grilled cheese and tomato soup. And I think we have tomato soup. What? You're going to wait. Yes, you is. You're going to wait. Yes, you are. <laughs> you little shit. Little shit. Little shit. <laughs> Get the beauty. <laughs> Now you want to play. Now he wants to play. Huh. He wants to play. You want to play. You want to play with Mama. Where's one of your balls out of your string, huh? <laughs> yeah, we might. I might suggest that for dinner. It's easy to make. We have one of them grills like Aniki has where she made them little sliders on the other night on her on her video on her stream and um, that's where we make our grilled cheese and our hamburgers and his pancakes his grill is um French toast. That's what we might have tomorrow night. I'm not making suggestions. Because <clears throat> we're trying to stretch our stamps since we ain't getting any next month. We're trying to stretch them. <clears throat> so we're trying to make small dinners. I've just got to figure out this 
AdSense crap. Because I, I don't know. It's also asked for my tax stuff. I don't do taxes. Not since I'm on Social Security. I know you can do them, but I don't even know what I'm filling out. So I'm not even going there. Yeah, I know. That sucks. But they said, and I was on um, Jojo Walker's stream earlier, and they were talking about stuff like that. And they, I mean, the subject went from one subject to another subject to another subject. But um, if you want um, Maddox's address again, I can give it to you if you want his address again to send his family a, a condolences card. Um, but, um, yeah, and they said anybody that has WIC, I mean, somebody said that they looked it up that was in the chat, and they said your WIC, if you're, if you're, if you get WIC for your child, it's good, it'll well be ending in April. If this shutdown keeps going, WIC will be ending in April. I know, and it's going to freaking kill us. Because like JoJo said, Trump is a big baby. He's stomping his feet until he gets what he wants. He even offered, I seen, I don't know if it was him or somebody else, but he even offered to fund the wall. And the Democrats turned it down. But there's a bill, one of the bills that he proposed is going through Congress. I don't know if it made it through or not, but these Democrats need to learn, hey, you're hurting the rest of us. You may be getting a big paycheck, but we're not. We're not getting paid. We're not getting what we're supposed to be getting. And I'm glad that the Social Security part is not touched. I'm glad that part's not touched and we'd all be out of a house and are on that stuff. We'd all be out of a home. I'm glad the Social Security part's not being touched. I'm glad they're not shut down. And these people doing your taxes, some of them are working with no pay. People at the IRS, half of them are working with no pay. They're working at the IRS with no pay. And there's a bunch of people that work for the government that are, that it has a, this, that their department or whatever has shut down because of it. They're suing. They're suing. I seen that on the news tonight. Some of the people that they're, government departments are shut down they're suing because it's not right that's not the way the laws are written that is otherwise considered what do they call it child labor or working or working with no pay I don't know what they call that but it's Something to do with an old law that's still in effect. Working and not getting paid for it. It's a law that they're 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 not keeping up with. They're, it's a law that they're not abiding by. Because Trump can't have his way. And as long as Trump can't have his way, will the rest of us do without? I'm glad when he gets out of office. I hate to be political, but I am so glad. The 
But see, I can't vote. I mean, they just passed a law for felons with nonviolent crimes, which mine is, can vote. But I look at it as I know I should be out and voting, but when I did vote, it didn't matter because the person I voted for never got in office. So. And it's really sad that he's doing this. It's really sad. Really is. It really is sad. That because he can't have his way, he's making the rest of us hurt. This is, I mean, really ridiculous. But on another word, on another thought, you're going to fall off. Come here. He's wanting to play and he's going sliding down my legs. Thank you, James. So just let anybody you know that has a child that's on WIC or has a is on week for the child. Let them know that it'll be running out in April. Do be do be do be do be be do be do be do. It's a daddy ball. It's a daddy ball. <laughs> well, yeah, drink some, eat some crackers, honey. Drink some water, eat some crackers. Tomorrow I got to figure out this stuff. Come on, the baby. Hey, she be baby. Baby, 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 baby. Whoa. Come here. So, guys, I am going to be ending this soon because I don't know what else to talk about. <laughs> and this one's driving me bananas. Because he wants to eat. You've got food out in the bowl. Go eat that till I'm done. Little stink. Good night, everybody. Thank you for coming in, and I'm glad that YouTube worked tonight. I don't know what's up with YouTube. They need to straighten their stuff out. <clears throat> Good night, everybody. God bless. Be safe. Sleep well. Have an awesome night. Amber, feel better. Carla, feel better. Everybody else is not feeling well. Mar Morris, prayer is still going out to you. Tara, prayer is going out to you and your dad. Guys, you know you guys are always in my prayers. Have an awesome evening. Peace, light, and kitties. Come on. Hang on. My old button doesn't want to work, so I gotta get my